Hi, I'm Seng. So today I'll show you how to set up your dual screen, your castle display in I mean D3505 device in Fuzzet. Thank you. So first, go to your browser and type ptechsolution.com.my then press enter. Then, this is my website. Go to the search and type Z customer display and press enter. Then click on here. After you click it, then it will go to here. Download the whole folder. After you download, just open the folder. You will see there's a dual screen GIF and a PowerPoint. So this is the PowerPoint slide that you can edit for your slideshow. Open the slide first. So make sure that you prepare three photos of your restaurant or the food. From here, you can see there's a fixed three slide for it. So click on the first slide and insert your photo into it. After you insert, you can adjust it. So make sure your photo is covered for the full slide. So for example, you can make it like this. So this is a slide that you're gonna do see from the dual screen. Then you go to the second slide. So I'm gonna enlarge it. So it shows something like this. And for the third slide, do something like this. After that, just click save and then click on the file and export as PNG. So I export to the desktop. So for the width, make sure you type S 1280 and the height is 720. Then just click export, make sure it's PNG and this. Then click export. So close it. So after success exported, you choose it at here. Go to your browser and go to GIF Maker, this website. Then upload the image. So you upload the image just now and click open. So for the canvas sizes, just make it 100%. And for the millisecond, you put it 2005. 2005 millisecond means that 2.5 seconds. If you want to make 3 seconds, then just put 3. 000. Then just click create GIF animation and download the GIF. Once you download the GIF, then you rename it as logo. So it will become logo GIF. When you open it, it's a GIF that every 3 seconds will next to the slide. Okay, again, go to the second half which is the logo. So just open it. Make sure that you have your logo. You can customize your own thank you or welcome message. So for example, I put my logo, I put it here. So this is a slide and I change the size. Then from here, maybe I can put my own QR code for my website, I put like this. So if you want to put some wording, you can put something like this. Let's say for example, thank you for supporting us. So I enlarge it then put the file and export as PNG also. So in here, for the width is 508 and the height is 702. I export to my desktop, just click export. I have my slide here, I also rename it as logo. So for this one, this page is for, it will display when you print the receipt or during transaction. And this one, it will show all the time and keep rotating the slideshow. So this is logo PNG and this one is logo GIF. Then I open the folder just now. Go to the second folder. For the home, I delete the original GIF. I move the logo GIF into this folder under the home folder. And then for the receipt, I go to the storage. I delete it and I move it. So in the receipt, storage and logo PNG will show this. I plug in with my pen drive. Then I open my pen drive. So inside the dual screen GIF, I successfully copy the logo GIF and my receipt, my logo PNG. Then I copy the second folder, I copy and paste to my pen drive. You take out your pen drive, 
after you eject the pen drive from your laptop, then plug into the I mean. So for the USB port, it will be located at here. Just plug in like this. After you plug in, then go to the Play Store and then you search File Manager. Just click Search. Then you download for this the File Manager. Once you download, just click Open. So it will shows that this I mean device has detected the pen drive. Just click on the pen drive and just hold it the tick button and just click copy and paste to the foot set folder make sure there's no other folder there and just click paste after paste it will show something like this and storage will have your logo and your receipt will this this logo png then go to the foot set go to the setting go to the Internet of Thing. Make sure you type this accordingly. Then after that, just click Save and Exit and restart the apps. Then you open the footstep again. So in your second screen, the reflection will keep rotating. If you do some payment, your customer display will show the details of your company. That's all for today. Thank you. Double system, laughing.